So over in the Atlantis facility in the gift shop, uh, I donated uh, some years ago uh, my bicycle uh, to the museum and they've got it on display over there and it's the same bicycle that I had back when I was in junior high school. I uh, did restore it though. I used to ride that bike to the airport. All I ever wanted to do since I was a little kid was be a pilot and we lived not far from Minneapolis St. Paul International which was Wolf Chamberlain Field back then and there was a naval air station there and I'd go out to the end of the runway ride my bike out there and I'd watch the A4s and P2 Neptunes fly in and out of there and I said, man, wouldn't it be neat to be a, a naval aviator and fly off aircraft carriers and, and be a pilot? So that was, that was my goal and that started when I was five years old and I just kept uh, working toward that goal, was able to go to the U.S. Naval Academy, fortunate enough to make it into pilot training as a Marine and eventually a test pilot and uh, after a couple of tries was able to get down to Houston in the astronaut program. And, my motto, what I always tell students is, first off, find out what your passion is, because if you go after your passion, you're gonna do well at it, and you're gonna enjoy life. My passion was flying, and if you have a goal, don't give up. You don't often get things on the first try, but keep trying, and when you achieve that goal, then set a new one and move on. I, I didn't get into pilot training on the first try, I didn't get into test pilot school on the first try, and I didn't make it into the astronaut program on the first try, but one kind of led to the other, and I never gave up, and I, I've been blessed to have a, a dream career and, and fly with some of the greatest people anywhere in the world.